you believe in collective, collective punishment? punishment? Yes. I believe that there is no more army that's more moral in the world than the Israeli army. Asking you a question as a public space. Are you here for more money for his Are you a public servant, sir? No. No, he's not a public servant. servant. He's an APEX. He buys Congress. So you're killing yeah. you're killing my people with the money that APEX is giving us. And destroying our democracy by spending a hundred million dollars to get rid of people who are concerned about human rights. You need to stop going after You are people destroying our country. You are destroying the people of Palestine. You are a cancer on yes. this system, and you are making us less safe for allegiances to Israel, not the United States, and shame on you for what you are doing. Shame for having no humanity, that you don't care about over 30,000 people have been slaughtered. Of my people, how dare you? I was taught as a Jew that we're not supposed to allow what happened to us to happen ever again to anyone. Well, you hear about Jehovah? No, as long as no one's impeding you. you are they are walking. You're standing in my way. They're not letting me go. You are walking, sir. We're not impeding your way. We're just following you to get some answers. Because we have that right. I'm the daughter of a Holocaust survivor. My mother escaped Germany in 1939. I know very well what a genocide can do to a people. And it pains me, aches me, anguishes me that every day my people are pursuing a genocide against a faceless, voiceless Palestinian people what? that you have helped to create facelessness and voicelessness to wake up to humanity and allow us all to be human to each other. Stop the war ceasefire now. Why are Palestinian lives less important than Israeli lives? It's really disgraceful and disgusting that you would even not care about over 14,000 children have been maimed and slaughtered from your doings. APEC is killing my people, and you have nothing to say about it? Palestinian blood is on your hands, and you will answer to that one day. Loving to get the aid that Israel needs right now, immediately. For now? For continuing to slaughter the people in Gaza? Does Israel need the military? You know that. Yes. You know that. Let's, let's go down to the so you think Israel needs more funding? Everybody goes to the restroom. Everybody in the restroom. That's good. Well, why were you here? Setting curiosity, what is it that you're lobbying for? Oh, to support Israel. So there's the $14 billion package. Absolutely. Right. Actually, it actually should be more billion. than that, I believe. There actually was discussion about it being $17 billion. Every person, even more people? Every person, no, from, Hamas, <laughs> every person from Hamas. Every person from Hamas. What do you think about, what do you ladies think about the hostages? Wait, what do you think about the hostages? Person, we every want terrorist. them freed, which okay. is why so we want a Hamas? ceasefire. After October 7th, you know there's been over 30,000 people killed. Do you feel okay about that? According to Hamas? Who do you think is Well, let me ask you something. Haven't you seen? Let me ask you something. Where if, if, Where's the I, I, I've seen a lot of pictures. Have you seen uh, the 47 minute video? No, I would like Hamas to see it. How could I see that? Uh, I, I don't have been just get it. Well, I've been asking. If, 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 how'd you feel when 9 11 happened? 9 11 happened. I felt like we should have taken the people who attacked us and brought them to justice, not invade Afghanistan, not oh, really? invade Iraq. Oh, never and so what so, we're doing what do you now, think? So, like, when, do when you Japan, believe in collective when, punishment? When, when, Can you answer me now? I've sure. answered your question. Do you believe in collective, collective punishment? punishment? Yes. I believe that there is no more army that's more moral in the world than the Israeli Listen, army that goes out of its way to protect civilian rights much more so than any army in the world. What happened in, in, when, when Japan attacked the United States? Do you States think that what Israel has done yeah. for the last five years is, is protect civilians when 30,000 of them have died? They, 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 Israel, Israel, Israel could have knocked out 
made uh, the Gaza parking lot if they wanted to on day one. Why do they have uh, why do they have military they there? They are making they could Gaza have, a parking could have, lot. They turned it yeah. into a slaughterhouse. Yeah. Gaza yeah. Is, is that why the they people is that are why they drive? Is, is, is that why they is that why they drive? Why they let yes, down the, uh, that's and why. send tax everybody to move before oh, they go and, and now they're starving them. Now they're starving them. Are they allowing in food and medicine? Yes, they are. Sure. The food and I want to ask you, what about the thousands of trucks that are waiting on the border that are not allowed in? A lot, a, a lot of them are coming in, and guess who's taking them all? You know what? They're not allowed all in. And yes, they are. are Hamas is taking them and using them as human the, shields. Are you using concerned them as about shields. the people who are starving? Tell me what you're lobbying for. I'm not talking to you. Are you embarrassed about what you're well, are you concerned about 30,000 people who died, mostly women and children? Let's talk as Jew to Jew. I was told that killing is wrong and that we shouldn't engage in collective punishment. Is that something you believe as a Jew? Do you believe that what Israel is doing is collective punishment? Do you believe in starving people in that? Weren't we starved and murdered? Isn't that what Israel is doing now to the Palestinians? Does it never again mean never again for any of us? It's shameful what Israel is doing and what you are supporting. It makes me ashamed to be a Jew. So while you're having your lunch, I want you to think about the Israeli war crimes for your children. Thank you. It is important to think about it. I know it's uncomfortable to think about it. Have you been there? Maybe you should go there. I've been there seven times. While you're having your lunch, just think about the children in Gaza who are starving. So we were in the halls of Congress today while APAC was also here, the pro-Israel lobby, with our sign saying APAC supports genocide and handing out flyers that show the intense suffering of the war crimes that uh, Israel is committing. We would put them on their tables while they were having lunch and they would rip them up. Uh, and we were also here to say to them that they are destroying our democracy. Um, they are now investing a hundred million dollars to try to get rid of anybody in Congress who's shown any concern for the Palestinian people. So we're here to say that APAC is a destructive force in Israel and for the Palestinian people and here in the United States in terms of trying to get uh, our Congress to listen to the majority of American people who say they want to cease fire and no more weapons to Israel instead of listening to APAC and APAC's money.